It's Salt Lake City 2002, the 1,000 metre speed skating final. I'm sitting in the change room. I had some good fortune in the semi and I was lucky to be there. Looking at the other skaters I'm about to race, Apollo Ono, USA, Jai Jun Lee, China, Han Suan, Korea, Matthew Turcotte, Canada. For a fleeting moment, I think, maybe I can do this. It's the final, I've trained for it. So I turned to my little legend Chinese coach, Ann Zhang, and she said, Steve, you don't stand a chance. Stay out of the way, hope for a mistake, and pick up a bronze. I'm on the starting line. The gun goes, bang, we're away. I went straight to the back as planned. Two laps to go, the lactic acid hits the legs. I'm tired. Heading into the final corner, Zhao Junli in second place. He wants the win, he tries a move on the outside, doesn't make it, digs his toe into the ice and falls. I set up my final turn and out of the corner of my eye, I see them all fall down. From that moment, it was done. I'm first across the finish line. Do I celebrate? What is the appropriate response here? I'm back in the change room. There's noise all around me. My coach is celebrating. My teammates are celebrating. I'm kind of enjoying it too. But on the inside, I'm crapping myself. Can I accept a gold medal? Everyone has just fallen over in front of me. What am I gonna say when the whole world asks me if I think I deserve to win or not? I'm headed to the podium. I think to myself, you know what? I deserve this. I've trained five hours a day, six days a week for 14 years. I've had a skater's blade clean through my right leg, lost four litres of blood, got 131 stitches. I've been head first into the barrier and broke my neck. Had a halo brace screwed into my skull. I can't take the gold medal for the 90 seconds of that race, but I can take it for all the hard work in the lead up. I'm probably the luckiest individual gold medal winner in history. Many people, however, believe luck is when preparation meets opportunity. Aussies are well known for not giving up. I got a question for you. When your opportunity presents, will you be ready to do a Bradbury?